Would you like to witness your friend's first few minutes in Minecraft doing this? Oh, oh look, oh look at all this. Oh wow, Minecraft. Oh, the sun's gonna go down quickly. I'm gonna need some wood. Oh, get some wood. Get in this wood. What? What's this? What? What? No! Ah! Do you just want to see a tree explode? Would you like to know how this is done in just seven easy steps? Then watch on to see how. And so, the way that you make it is, well, you need a tree. Pick a tree, any tree. I just planted a single tree here. Actually, let me show you that we can do this in survival mode. So I'm going to do game mode uh, S, and there we go. And in survival mode. And this is all the things that you need. You're going to need 24 grass or dirt, so you can, you know, you know, cover it up basically and make it look convincing. So, 24, I'm using grass at the moment. I'm gonna need four uh, blocks which are destructible. I'm using blue wool because it's with redstone. Don't worry, it's not complicated at all. Look, one redstone dust is all you need. Redstone torches, four of them. You need one lever and about, you can use how much TNT you like. I'm just going to use 12 because that is more than enough to do some serious damage to someone. I have got a diamond spade right here and it needs to be at least a 5x5 five five hole. So, oops. I'm used to doing this in creative mode, so. Uh, here we go. And as long as you do this right, it will be very, very, very scary for the person who activates this trap. What happens is when they destroy the bottom trunk, it will detonate basically. So yeah, uh, just making this all almost done. And I should also I should also tell you, it has to be too deep at least, or you can remove the bottom trunk. But I think it looks way more convincing if you just dig too deep because then you can have to put the tree on a little hill and it will just look a little strange and suspicious if you ask me so I think it's best to just dig two down like so get rid of all the dirt okay we've got this dirt now which we don't need and what you need to do next is just place one redstone directly underneath the tree is that here? Yeah, right there. Okay, the redstone dust goes right there. I'm going to put my blue wall all around. Ooh, not there. All around this here. So that it doesn't set off this tier tier that goes around. You know, that could be bad if you're standing in the hole. <laughs> so we just put that there. I'm going to put the lever, because due to the new update, you can put it underneath blocks. Switch that on and then the redstone dust is on. Cool. So now we get our redstone torches and put it around. This will deactivate the torches, which is what we need, because again, we don't want this TNT going off in our face, do we? Um, so when, basically, this is for when they just destroy this, the lever will go, which means there'll be nothing left to power the redstone dust, which means it will turn on the redstone torches, which will then activate the TNT. So the next part is the fun part. TNT, I'm going to put three in each corner. And again, like I said, it's more than enough to injure someone or even kill them as you saw at the beginning of the video. Then what you do, climb out, get your grass or dirt, and cover it all off. You need at least 24 if you're going to do 5x5 five five like I did. You don't need one for the middle part tree which is why you don't need 25. I'm sorry for the frame rate right now because I'm recording. 
Just need to do that another. Ugh. I lost it. I lost it somehow. Whoops. Uh, we had some dirt here. Just remembered. If you use dirt, you have to wait for the grass to spread over it to look more convincing. Uh, but yeah. Yeah. That's, that's it. And then, well, they're the six steps. So basically, let's just recap. The first one is choosing a tree. Done. Check. Second step, dig two blocks down and do a 5x5 five five hole. Check. Three, place the uh, redstone dust underneath. Cover it around with wool or something like that. Place the lever on the bottom and switch it on. That's step three. Check. Step four will be to add the redstone torches around. Check. And then the fifth one, add the TNT. Check. Six, cover it all up. Check. Seven, watch your friends suffer. Haha. -ha. Look at the blast radius as well. Ah! <laughs> I knew that was coming then, so I could get out the way. But look at the blast radius, come on. Oh, and also chests don't explode, so, um, yeah. I got a sapling! <laughs> and the top of the tree will remain, depending on how big the tree is. So, uh, oh yeah, another reason why I wouldn't just remove the bottom uh, log of the tree before setting it all up is because I think it'll look a little more unconvincing, because the tree will be made a little shorter, and uh, I think it's best to just leave it at uh, the full tree. Look, even spread out here a little bit as well. So, uh, yeah, that's very cool. And uh, the tree that you're going to choose, I'd recommend if they are not starting Minecraft and if they have a base or somewhere and they need wood and you know that, then you can choose a tree that's right outside their base. They can, you know, destroy the bottom log and then boom! Perfect for raiders as well. Wow. So there you go, that is how to make this. Okay, thanks for watching this video guys. Uh, if you liked this and found it useful, please give me a like, it'll help me out a lot. And uh, tell me in the comments if you tried this out and how well it went, and tell me what your friend's reaction was. Please try this out on a friend, uh, let me know how it went basically. And uh, if you want to see more videos like this, um, well, basically just click the subscribe button please to just let me know uh, that you want to see more videos like this. Plus there are going to be more videos coming out on my channel of different topics and all that sort of stuff. Maybe Let's Plays or Walkthroughs with different games. Maybe more Minecraft with friends. Uh, yeah, just uh, you can even post uh, in the comments what you'd like to see. Um, I can tell you how to make more traps for your friends, so you can hilariously uh, trap them, basically. Um, you know, I can give loads of more traps like, like this away, so uh, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you later, you've been beautiful, bye!